about a year ago I had a bad injury, ski injury on my right knee and it was the ligament it, uh, which was completely broken and the doctors uh, recommended to me very urgently to operate it because they told me I'm young, I need to operate otherwise I will have arthritis or something like this. So, um, well I was not very convinced of the operation because um, it would uh, take me about two weeks uh, to recover from the operation and it, they told me it's still not very clear whether I will be able to rely on my, on my knee again and so and so on. So I uh, decided to try something different and by chance I uh, found Dr. Naram and I asked him to help me and he did this beautiful mama to me and it was a really, really, how do I say, a very, very unknown experience to me because um, um, he pushed twice on my spine and I could feel clicking, like click, 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 and then again click, 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 and it was, oh well, I feel so, so um, comfortable now and something happened also to my knee, but um, the results I could first see after about two days. I could stretch my knee uh, before... Can you show me? Yes, I could stretch before this mama. I could stretch my knee like this. I, mm. Mm, and that was over. Mm. If I tried to stretch more, I was feeling pain. So it was really not possible. And <clears throat> after two days, I just was trying and, and trying. What happened? What did somebody happen to me? Did it help? Did it not help? Am I just thinking something happened, but after two days I definitely could stretch my knee completely. If I, I can stand up, yeah. and a year ago I only had this broken ligament, there was no broken meniscus or bones, everything was fine, but just the Vordere Kreuzband, Vordere Kreuzband, I don't know, like this was completely broken, ligament and this rigam complete ligament rupture, and this was completely broken. Hmm. So I, I, when I visited Dr. Naram, I could stretch the knee like this, yeah, and more, this was not possible because it was very painful. Mm. And after two days, after Marma, I could stretch completely, <laughs> yes, completely, and maybe one degree was still missing, but um, I had no pain and I had like definitely more stability in the knee. <laughs> wow. Did you go, I'm just curious, did you go back to doctors? What did they say? Well, I went to uh, yeah, I went once again to um, my doctor, and I made this MRT, and they said, well, uh, the MRT doctor said, like, um, excuse me, have you been to to me uh, half a year ago to to check your knee? Yes, because it's strange. I must have made a, dis a mistake. And I said, what mistake? Well, I told you it was a complete full ligament rupture, but it, now it looks like it is partial ligament rupture. And I said, oh, well, that's a nice mistake, thank you very much. But I was really not sure, was it his mistake or was it the mama? Honestly, I'm not sure yeah. what it was. Uh, so, well, so I can show you the, the result now if you film it, yeah. which is completely not possible. Um, a year ago, I could... I could go like this and, and, and somehow, you know, try to sit like this, but more was not possible. I couldn't put my whole weight on this knee. It was not possible. But now it's not a problem at all. <laughs> I, you know, I can sit like this. I can even go like this. No? <laughs> wow. It's not a problem. I have no pain. It's, I feel still a little bit of clicking in the knee, but it's not, it's not painful. So I think I have like maybe 98% of my old knee back again. No pain, no problems, nothing. Wow, amazing. So from, from your perspective, since you were living with her, what did you see? What was life like before for her, physically, mentally, emotionally, day to day? How did it affect her before? After the injury? Yeah, after the injury, yeah. <laughs> well, after the injury, that was a, well, the tough start because uh, she had to go on sticks for about uh, two weeks. Yeah, there was no, no way to drive car or manage uh, the house or do anything. Yeah. Um, well, she did a lot of sports, so-called uh, healing gymnastics.
Mm. I think that helped uh, the muscle part to 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 um, to help the knee. But then, mm -hmm. but then that was really when we had been seeing Dr. Naram in, in Berlin and after the Mama session, it was, it was a, a, a massive change for her and uh, well, she was definitely relieved in a better mood and she saw things are, are possible yeah, and that she, that she thought she can make it without an operation, which was still unclear at that point in time mm -hmm. because a complete ligament rupture is normally a good reason and the, 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 the Western medicine is, is definitely wants you to do the operation which she didn't want to do on full narcosis and with all the, the things that happen. I wasn't quite sure if she can manage because again, you know, there are people telling you that uh, at a certain point in time you will have to do an operation because you can't manage mm -hmm. sports and things like this and, and nowadays it's no problem for her to, to, to go with our 40 kilogram dog for a walk yeah, and that dog has a lot of power at the beginning that, that was not possible for her because you know the dog changing uh, position changing side and then he has a lot of power which he could manage with, with the knees and, and, and now it's like uh, there was never an injury at least for me not really visible she, she feels still that it's not a hundred percent but I think we went a long way from 10% to 90%, so all good. Yeah. So um, I was surprised positively and uh, it's nice to be in, in, in that she's in, in that shape and situation now. I believe that there's a certain medicine which you can't explain yeah, and which is definitely you know, something the, the normal school medicine can't explain. So I, I'm, I would say 51% I believe it, <laughs> it happened because of uh, Mama and her good feelings and her willingness to, to get it fixed without operation. I, I believe that the Mama was really powerful. Mm -hmm. I could see after two days and I could uh, also feel straight after the Mama that something changed, but my brain, it was too much. I, I couldn't really explain. Yeah? And it was like, oh, many, many <laughs> things happening. Yeah, I have to go, I have to leave because I have to <laughs> somehow understand. But it was not possible to understand this mama and what happened. It was different. Yeah. But after the days, two days, it was, I could clearly see. Yeah. You know, because many people rely on um, what the doctor is telling. You know, you have to operate, there is no help, there is a serious injury. But um, the body, can heal itself, even with this acute um, injury, you just need to know how, yeah. you know, an operation is definitely not the right way in my, my view, you know, if you even look at Lindsay, Lindsay Wayne, yeah. you know, it did not really work, you know, it just bro is broken again and it's, yeah. it's just... You don't have the, um, the guarantee that the operation is going to help. And in my opinion, it's definitely not going to help. It makes the things worse. Mm -hmm. So if there is a natural medicine, an expertise, how to, to cure this injury, it's much, much better. Yeah. Because it is possible without any operation. It's just, it just takes time and um, discipline. And uh, well, you can help yourself with a little bit of help of Dr. Naram. You, you don't really need the operation. Namaskar. I am Dr. Pankaj Naram. After seeing thousands and thousands of people now in Europe, especially Holland, France, Frankfurt, Germany, Italy, all over, I have come to a big conclusion that many things are possible. You must have seen a wonderful story of this wonderful girl who was told that you have to go for surgery. And she chose her own way to help her knees with natural remedies from ancient secrets like Herbo Kale Formula, Sandhi Shakti Formula, Darda Mukti formula, Flexi joint formula, taking ghee every day in the morning, turmeric powder half teaspoon in the morning and today her joints are much better and she is happy 
I am happy and the message is there is always a way. Only what we need to do and we need to ask ourselves what I need to do, what discipline I need to follow, what diet I need to follow, what herbal remedies, home remedies, diet, lifestyle and what murmur I need to do. Anyone who, is a, who has a knee pain, joint pain, stiffness, I would strongly recommend them. Press this marma. From here, this finger, you take out four fingers like this and this is the marma. One, two, three, four, five, six. And you will see some wonderful results coming. I invite you to change your life forever. Namaskar. Well, when I saw Dr. Naram, I already have seen many, many um, uh, films of him on YouTube. Mm. And I had the feeling that he can help. I think that um, Siddha Veda or Ayurveda are a really great, um, is a great medicine. You know, and we should be happy that um, Dr. Naran is coming over, over the world, visiting us because it would be for us not possible to go to India to see him. Mm -hmm. And honestly, for me, is Dr. Naran now our family doctor. Because, <laughs> yes, because I think um, what's the, you know, the, the school medicine, they cannot prevent many things. Or if you are really, really ill, they see. But before, they cannot really see. And um, Siddha Veda or Ayurveda or traditional Chinese medicine, if the doctor is really experienced and good, then he can predict many diseases. Yeah? And it's up to you, you believe it or not. But I, I do believe it. Yes, because some things you can already feel and you know, something is coming, something is not right. And if there is a doctor Naram and he tells me, well, be careful, Arthritis might be the problem for you. You need to, to change your diet. I believe it. I think it has a lot of experience. Dr. Naram, thank you very much for helping us so much till now. We are your patients uh, since four years already, my family and me. And I can tell you that you are our family doctor. So uh, we will come again and again and listen what, to what you are saying and telling us. And thank you once again for helping. Well, I have to say, I was not a strong believer when we, when we were coming. I mean, Danuta was figuring out all that and, you know, I never really looked deeper into it. But when I met Dr. Nar Nara first time, I saw his energy, his energy level and, 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 and how much he can give to people and, and how hard he was working, you know, in, in Berlin from morning till night, second day and then, then Mama and he was still full of power. I, I, I really. I really understood that, that, that he has things to tell and to teach and to, to share which, which, which are desirable and I'm, I'm really proud and happy I met him. Yeah, I, I lost uh, 10 kilograms even I didn't want to but by, by having a diet, living a bit more healthy um, and, and, and uh, taking in consideration the things he, he, he told us I definitely feel feel uh, much better than a year ago. Yeah, and we and we uh, manage nicely as a family. So uh, thanks for the good spirit and uh, the good uh, ideas he shared with us.